Fatigue, we can define as a tiredness which is not resolved with rest. More broadly fatigue has been as a feeling of weariness, tiredness, or lack of energy. People describe fatigue differently, because it is subjective experience, weakness, tiredness, and lethargy are most common description of fatigue. Fatigue should composed of three components. 1. Generalized weakness, difficulty in initiating activities. 2. Easy fatigability, means difficulty to complete things. 3. And mental fatigue, difficulty to concentrate and focus on something and impaired memory. In majority of cases fatigue and tiredness follows prolonged physical or mental activity, and it is normal body reaction. Also normal fatigue occurs under stimulation, boredom and lack of sleep or disease. Such fatigue usually resolves with sleep and rest. Otherwise, variety of diseases can cause fatigue. One of the most common disorders which can cause fatigue are depression, common cold, influenza virus infection, COVID-19, vitamins and mineral deficiencies. If fatigue lasts more than six consecutive months, it is called chronic fatigue. It can be caused by more serious conditions like hypothyroidism, hypothyroidism, heart failure, chronic obstructive lung disease, lung fibrosis, almost all end-stage organ diseases, sleep apnea, cancers and almost any disorder. Fatigue can be caused by medications, like beta blockers and chemotherapy drugs. When fatigue lasts more than six months, and it cannot be explained by any underlying disease, it is called chronic fatigue syndrome. Such fatigue worsens with physical and mental activity, but doesn't improve with rest. This condition also called myalgic encephalomyelitis. Some chronic fatigue syndrome will resolve itself in time, but some of them will worse. There is no treatment for it, but CDC recommends personal activity management to keep mental and physical activity to avoid symptoms making worse. The management of fatigue is identify and treat the underlying condition. Generally, resistance training and aerobic exercise decreases fatigue. Psychostimulants can have some effects in case of cancer-related fatigue. Testosterone replacement therapy is effective in men with hypogonadism. Cognitive behavioral therapy can have positive effects on cancer patients.